Hey, welcome to another video. I've done this a couple times with the framing's been pretty awful, so what I'm doing is I'm preparing some uh, tinder for a fire. And the fire is gonna be using solar panels to uh, spark steel wool. I didn't think this was possible. After doing a lot of investigating and poking around, I thought, okay, well, it's the not the voltage necessarily that starts the fire, it's the, the current or the amperage that comes with it. This is sile seal, sisal, sisal, yeah, sisal rope, but it's gonna be our tinder bundle here, so I'm just kind of roughing it up. Really flammable stuff, a little bit better than jute twine if you ask me. And we're gonna take that, set it aside here, and grab myself some steel wool out of the trusty container. You don't need a whole lot of this stuff. Hold it together, and these right here are the solar panels we're gonna use. They're 500 milliamps each, so, that equates to 1.5 amps of current. Or so the trick is getting them aligned right so that they're all in the sun. So here's the solar panels. And uh, just got to touch it to that steel wool, that tag in down there. They're soldered together. Try to make it so you guys can see it. Put it in the shade a little. Touch it. Oop, had a little spark. Add another one. There's ignition right there. Let just take it and blow it. And put your tinder into it. And there you go. There's the fire and uh, yeah, all we did was use a solar panel, or three solar panels and some steel wool. That's pretty much it, not too difficult. I mean, these don't weigh that much less than a nine volt battery but the problem is you got to have a pretty clear sunny day like we got now to make it work and it does work so 500 milliwatts each um 1.5 watts uh, of, of juice there was enough to spark the steel wool and get it to light and anyway that's uh yeah that's burning my heart up i don't really care but uh, yeah, that's, that's all it really took to get the steel wool to go. And pretty, I mean, that, that works pretty good. I like that. It's, to me, it's, it's better than carrying the nine volt battery because the nine volt battery always, always has the potential to ignite something if it's not stored properly. And this does not. There you go, steel wool and a, <laughs> and a solar can start a fire. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me on this video. I love your faces and we will see you on the next one. Bye.